Hi, hello. Today I have this dramatic kind of teal warm toned eye look. It's a bit different. It's inspired by an, a makeup artist on Instagram. I will get her picture up now. Her name is In Seas Makeup. I will link her Instagram down below so you can go see it but I loved how she created the cut crease and then brought it down into the lash line. I love it. It is really creative and gorgeous so go give her a follow. Without further ado if you want to see how I created this eye look then keep on watching. Okay, so we are going to start by priming the lid. Obviously, I've done this eye, well, half of this eye. I'm going to be priming the lid with the P. Louise base. This is in the shade Zero, which is the white shade. I'm just going to buff that out with a brush. Like so. Now I'm just going to carve out my eyebrows using my brow pomade that I always use. I'm just going to carve out the lower part of my eyebrow for now. carve out my eyebrows a little bit, I'm going to take the concealer we're going to be using and just carve out the eyebrows. Today I'm going in with the Morphe and Jaclyn Hill eyeshadow palette. I haven't used this a ton on my channel so I want to use it a bit more. I'm going to take this shade which is called Creamsicle and I'm going to put this in my crease. I'm going to bring this quite high because I want it to show when we put all the other shades on. Okay, so then the next shade we're going to take Pucky, which is like a warm brown shade. And I'm going to put this lower down in the crease. And then next we're going to take Hunt, which is this burnt orange red shade. And I'm going to take this lower down in the crease again. Lastly, I'm going to take the shade Mocha, which is this dark brown shade. Okay, so then that is basically all the eyeshadow. Now I'm going to use the P. Louise base to cut the crease. Okay, so now we're going to go into Poolside, which is this really nice shimmery teal shade. And I'm putting this all over where we put that concealer. Okay, 
Okay, so then to line the upper lash line, like on this side, I'm gonna take Twerk, which is the purpley blue shade, and just focus on the lash line, but then blending it up into the teal shade. Okay, so then to finish this off, I'm going to get a makeup wipe and just wipe off any fallout and also sharpen this outer edge. Next, then I'm going to take the Maybelline Massive Size Liquid Eyeliner in the shade Black, just to line my lash line a little bit for the false eyelashes. Okay, so the lashes I'm gonna go in with today are the Allure Most Wanted I Heart This Lashes. They're very dramatic, very spooky. I'm gonna apply these, do the rest of my face and stuff, and I'll be back. Okay, so let's do the lower lash line. So I'm gonna take Creamsicle, which is the yellow mustard shade, and I'm going to place that right under the, the lash line. And I'm gonna bring it all the way up here. And I'm gonna bring it quite far down. Then I'm gonna take Hunts, which is the burnt orangey red, and I'm going to put that closer to the lash line. The inner corner I'm going to take Beam, which is this really nice champagne shimmer shade. Then I'm just going to apply lower lash mascara. Like usual, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Miss Baby Roll. Okay, so that is the eyes done. I'm going to zoom out and we'll do lips. Please ignore my hair, it's just frizzy and messy and... Okay, so for lip liner today, I'm gonna to be using the MAC Lip Liner in Whirl. Just a nice nude for the lip line. And then for the lips, I haven't tried this before. This is recently new in the haul I did. I'll link it in the eye. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Lip Gloss in the shade Butterscotch. Just looks like this. Really nice nude pink peachy tone and it, apparently they're quite pigmented so I thought I'd use this on its own wow oh these smell nice okay so that is the final look if you want to know what is on my face then I did a foundation review that won't be up for a little bit after this video because I'm going to be doing a 12 days of drugstore slash affordable foundations so stay tuned for that. Make sure to subscribe to my channel to make sure you don't miss out on that series. And turn my no notifications on because the little bell, because then it will notify you when that does come. Any other videos of mine, make sure to thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the eye look. I love you to the moon and back and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.